what I always say. I say that I'm not here to teach you, I'm here to learn. I say that I'm ignorant, yet I'm open-minded. I love learning from people who watch my videos and leave me comments, especially people from other parts of the world where there's that cultural divide. So I made a t uh, DNA test video. Uh, DNA test results, why are Americans obsessed with Jews and Mexicans? Which I happen to be, have traces of both. Fabrice Laborne, one of my newest favorite subscribers, because I learned so much from him. I'm just gonna read kind of the opening line of the comedy left on that video. Quote, nobody in Europe sees Jewish people as Middle Eastern at all. Jews are part of European history since so much time that is mostly part of us. Jews are seen more of a, of a religion and certainly not a race nor an ethnicity, end quote. Now, go on and read the rest of the comment because it's, it's important stuff, but for the Americans watching this video, that's really what I want to focus on. I want, as an American, who, what I just read, that's foreign to me, I want to attempt to process that. That Jewish people are not Middle Eastern. Let me, let me try to process the fact that Jewish people are not Middle Eastern. I guess what I have to figure out is, why do I think Jewish people are Middle Eastern? And I think that uh, it would go back to the Bible, whether it's the Christian Bible or whether it's the Jewish Bible, the ultimate, whatever part of the Bible we're looking at, when, we, when I think of Jewish people, I think of, yeah, the religion, but I also think of a certain ethnic group of people. And yes, they could convert and things like that, but still, I still think of people even with certain physical traits that typically if someone's a Jewish American versus someone who is of English descent, I, I'm going to be able to pick apart, yeah, that probably, person's probably Jewish. I can tell that. I can physically see that in most cases, in most cases. You know, Paul Rudd is an exception to the rule. Paul Rudd is Jewish, ethnically Jewish. That's a surprise to me, but he definitely grew up Jewish and is Jewish, okay? But for me to understand, so why do I keep thinking that Jewish people are specifically Middle Eastern? I think it's probably because of the biblical text because we see their history <laughs> going back for thousands of years. We can see where they started out geographically and that's in the Middle East. And yeah, it's true. They definitely spread out all across the world. I've actually uh, read an article suggesting that there are just as many Jewish people in America than there are in, in Israel, actually in the Middle East. <laughs> so. Uh, maybe it's just a matter of context that we can, I continue as an American to think that Jewish people are Middle Eastern because that's where they started out. But in theory, well, didn't we all kind of start out there? <laughs> you know, people say, you know, cause my mom's DNA test shows she's like, what, you know, 2% African, which means by default, I'm 1% African by default. But you know, it's not that I can identify as an African American. And even then it's like, well, people find that out about me. They're like, well, yeah, I guess we're all African. We all, we all originally came from the same place, didn't we? So is that kind of what we're talking about? That if Jewish people aren't Middle Eastern, uh, then ultimately we all came from the Middle East or we all came from Africa. We all, you know, people of English descent and Norwegian descent, ultimately they all originated there. So to say that Jewish people are Middle Eastern because they originated in a certain part of the world, then we all, it's just that we don't have a religious text backing it up showing that. And especially as Americans, we were the some of the, we, we were here kind of last, you know, like you know, when 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 the European descent people start arriving in locations like New Zealand and, and Australia and Canada and in North America, you know, it's the we're the newest arrivals, but we forget that still though, had we not arrived here several hundred years ago and wherever we established land, you know, as far as Europe, Europe is much older than us, so. I think it's one of those American perspectives thing. It's like, it makes a lot of sense. I'm struggling to grasp it, that it's truth. But I'm curious, would you leave a comment and tell me where you're from and whether or not you identify Jewish people as Middle Eastern? Because in my mind, I'm always going to. I mean, even ethnic traits, I can, you can look at someone who's, who's Jewish and you can look at someone who's, let's say, Iranian, and you're gonna see more similarities between those two people compared to a guy who's from Belgium. I'm going to see more similarities between Middle Eastern people and Jewish people because in my mind, Middle Eastern people are Jewish. Now it is interesting, just for fun, I will point out that the more my mom and I research it, the more we realize that my Italian grandfather who, 
his father, which would have been my great grandfather, who he himself actually came from Italy, he and I actually have a lot of traits that look alike. And in theory, he was something like 8% Italian DNA, but the rest of them was pretty much split between a, uh, Jewish, Sephardic Jewish, and then the other half of him would have been, and it shows the map through my heritage, it would have been like, it, show, it zooms in on it as Iran, Iraq, Turkey. And we, we see it because my mom has an uncle who's like in his 80s or 90s and lives in a nursing home, and they had him take a test, and it pointed back to it. So it's, just, it's that much more confusing to me that Jewish people would not be Middle Eastern, and that someone who's of Scandinavian descent ultimately isn't also, if you go back far enough, came from the Middle East or Africa. I don't know. Remember, I'm an ignorant American who doesn't understand, but who's open-minded. So, would you leave a comment? Do you think Jewish people, do you perceive them as, as Middle Eastern? And would you also mind telling me what part of the world you're from and whether or not you yourself are Jewish or Middle Eastern? It helps me understand this perception issue. And, and perhaps, maybe, no one's right or wrong. Maybe it's simply a perception issue, especially for, some, for people who are Americans and not Jewish. That they, that they see Jewish as an ethnicity more so than a religion? Do you think Jewish people are Middle Eastern? What part of the world are you from and are you Jewish? That would help me understand this perception confusion. Comments right here, do it.